So here he is in the bucket. I just scooped him up with a flathead real slow. Flathead shovel. And um, and if I put my hand down in there, he would bite me and I'd be going to the hospital. Now, sometimes like with rattlesnakes, the little rattlesnakes, <laughs> venom is kind of more concentrated in some species than the larger ones, but larger ones can deliver a bigger dose. Um, so this little copperhead, you know, he'd be more than happy to bite me if I got in his business. But I just put some dirt in this bucket, not too full, just a tiny bit at the bottom. He can't really climb up those bucket walls. They can strike about half the distance of their body. So I'm fine with a bucket. I'm not going to hold it up by the handle like that because I don't want to risk anything. I'm going to grab it down here like this. What I'm going to do is I'm going to put a, a piece of netting over the top of this. And I'm going to drive him far away and let him loose somewhere else. Because I don't want him coming down here. And I don't really want to kill him because this is God's creatures. They're made the way they are for a reason. And we live alongside them. We just have to... We just have to learn to deal with it, right? So that's what we're going to do. Put them away in a new place.